Okay, so I'm going to show you how to hook up your PC speakers to a monitor. The videos I've seen left out one part for a PS4 Pro that it looks like the optical cable is important. So you can see that I have the monitor set up here. Okay, um, it's supposed to be faster um, and help with lag and I use it to play Elder Scrolls than the TV, which I have behind me. Please excuse the mess, I have not quite made it pretty yet. So these are the PC speakers that I have right here. And you can see that when I move this around, you can hear it. So that's obviously working. Okay, so you're going to want to have this digital converter box. This is the one that I found on Amazon. Okay, digital to analog converter. And the back here is where you're going to have it plugged into the Toslink, which is the optical output. You're gonna need this, I had to get this one separately. You can find some with them. Um, that's the, um, the cord right here. And then this plugs into, because I had this type of speaker. This is a male to female. Uh, adapter here um, and then that goes along and is part of the back of my speaker there's nowhere to actually plug anything in I just got these guys on Amazon too so what's important um, is that you need to make sure that it connects to the back here of the PS4 okay so that's that little port right there that needs to connect to so the ones that came um, the optical cord that came with it did not work, neither did another one that I had. Okay, so this is the one that came with it right here. It has this little bit at the end. Okay, it's kind of hard to see it there, but it's got like a white bit at the end. The one that I had to use was one that I found in a drawer, which probably came with the PS4 Pro, and it is like this. Okay, so it's hard for it to focus on that too. So you can see the end is different. Okay, and it's having a really hard time focusing on that. But that's how you can see the end is different. I plugged that one right in and it totally worked. Okay, so you just got, it fits, you'll know it's a good one because it fits in nicely in the back there. And you can just turn it to the side until you find the edge that fits. Okay, so that is about it. And that's how I have it set up. Hopefully that will help you.